Welcome to the program, Time to Think, with educator, philosopher, and international motivational expert, Dr. D. Paul Riley. Hi, this is D. Paul Riley with today's edition of Time to Think, entitled Thoughts, Words, and Deeds. My friend, today I'm going to outline the process whereby we bring anything which we want in life into actual reality. In other words, today's program will present a foolproof way in which to achieve success in all aspects of our life. Earl Nightingale's definition of success is the progressive realization of a worthy goal or ideal. So if that's true, and I believe it is, well then, we commence the whole process of becoming successful by thinking about exactly what we'd like to achieve in the future in all aspects of our life. As we think deeply about some of the things we'd like to achieve, we're actually setting up our goals for the future. As the thoughts flood into our fertile mind, we write them down, ending up with a list of specific goals and objectives, which we can then move progressively towards. So, the thoughts which we think are the commencement of the whole process of becoming successful. Now, the next part of the process which will assist us in actually achieving the goals which we've set for ourselves is to use words to impress exactly what we want on our subconscious mind. In other words, we set up a series of affirmations, one for each goal. As I've written about before, it is most important for these affirmations to be structured in the first person and present tense, as if what we're seeking has already been achieved. For example, if let's say we have a goal to lose 20 pounds in weight and we presently weigh 200 pounds, the affirmation will go like this. I am a slim, trim, 180 pounds. This is a foolproof way in which to assist you in making your dreams come true. So, we've thought deeply about what we wish to achieve, thus establishing a series of goals and objectives. We've also set up a series of affirmations, structured in the first person and present tense, to assist us in impressing our goals on the subconscious, which is a very important aspect of goal achieving. However, let's face it, we will never achieve anything in life unless we take the necessary action needed, in order to make our goals become reality. As the Bible tells us quite clearly, words without deeds will not get us anywhere in life. So we start to do what needs to be done daily to assist us in achieving our goals on target. So there you have it, my friend, the way in which you can become successful in life by thoughts, words, and deeds. Think about it.